the BE. This is Kirk Vertodazu Pop Yalek, 19, proudly representing the happy faces of Barangay Puok. <laughs> Binibini ikat ng lahi 2022 Queen of Queens Best in Casual Wear is Binibini number 7 Kirk Bob Yolek What is yours? Bini Bini! Seven! Kirk Papiolek! Four!
Once again, ladies and gentlemen, a warm round of applause for Be Bini Nangaikatlanglahi 2022 Queen of Queens Top 10 finalists. It's seven, Kirk Popiole. Wow. Towering beauty. Hello. Yes. Hi, how are you? I'm feeling great. Thank you so much for asking That's me good. that. How about you? I'm very, very good. Thank <laughs> you very much. Si Kirk, may, uh, yung may hugis bigas na mukha. Wow. Na napakaliit na mukha. Thank you. Fans, oh, oh. You know, I saw her backstage. I was mesmerized with her beauty. Ooh. We've been with a lot of beauty queens and you actually resemble one of them. But uh, I'll just tell you later. <laughs> <laughs> and nakausap ko rin siya backstage. She hails from... I am from the Timber City of the South, Butuan City. Imagine, so, Butuan. Actually, I just arrived yesterday just to be here representing Barangay Po. Oh. Wow. wow. Welcome to the Lion City of the South, yeah. Santa Rosa. Thank you so much for the warm welcome. And I will definitely come back because of the love and the support that the, good, that the people from Laguna are giving me. Thank you very much. All right. Let's see your question, Kirk. Oh, I got the last, last question. <laughs> Okay. Here is your question. What are your thoughts on the separation of church and state? Again, what are your thoughts on the separation of church and state? Thank you for that wonderful question. Ladies and gentlemen, we all have different points of view in life. We individuals, we have our different beliefs and our different um, expectations coming from our different experiences and of course the upcoming and the upbringing of our family but what is my opinion about the separation of the church and the state definitely i am okay with it because the best example of that is our muslim people if we just learn how to respect them with their religion and their church beliefs definitely we can also have that respect coming from them because it's not just about the church or the state itself but it's about compassion passion and love for each and everyone thank you thank you very much bini bini seven kirk popiolek of barangay po oh maraming, thank maraming you salamat. once again and to complete our finalists for tonight you are in Bini Bini! Seven! Kurt! Pump to your left! We've had male presidents and female presidents. Hypothetically, if the next president will come from the LGBTQIA community, what do you think would be their greatest strength as a leader of our country? That's a very great question. Ladies and gentlemen, I would, I would like to start my statement by saying, leadership do does not depend on someone's race, color, and even gender. We must always remember that what can women and men do, we also, the members of the LGBTQ community, can do it as well. Now, the question if, is there, if there is someone from the LGBTQ community who can lead our country, what would be our greatest strength? I would like to remind to all of you that we, members of the LGBTQ community, we are a combination between men and women. Naturally speaking, when it comes to leadership, men tend to think logically, while women, they think emotionally. And I think that is our greatest strength. Why? Because while we think logically what's better for our community, we also never forget what will happen to those people who will be affected with this action. And with this, I know in my heart that being an emotional and logical thinker at the same time, we can have a community who has a leader that can be um, effective in these ways because I know that having that heart and mind to serve a country is the greatest way to achieve a beautiful symphony of brotherhood. And with this, I think having all of these character characteristics that men and women does, I know in my heart that we LGBTQ community members 
we are ready to become the next leaders of our country with our experiences, bravery, and of course, all the challenges we have encountered in our life. Therefore, I can say, having an LGBTQ community leader will have a colorful community. Thank you and good evening. Thank you very much, Bini Bini 7 Kirk Pop Yolek. Bini Bini Ikatlung Lahi 2022 Queen of Queens is Bini Bini 7 Kirk Pop Yolek. Our Binibini Ikatlong Lahi Turismo is Binibini 8 Gang La Vitoria.